What up, folks? I'm Ultrazel, and today I have a review of the Funko Pops Godzilla X Kong, the new Empire Kong. That's all right, my Zillions. Didn't we do this already? Uh, sort of. We did the Target exclusive Kong. And uh, this is uh, the regular Kong, which I also got at Target. Uh, I, I, I got all of these dudes at Target, except these two, which are super. I don't know what that means yet. Uh, <laughs> guessing a little bit bigger, if you saw my Godzilla review, I pointed something out there about it. Uh, go check out that review, but we might point it out here again. Uh, we'll, we'll see, but this is the box, Standard Fair Funko Pop. Without any further ado, let's get to this review. And here's Kong out of the package. He looks mean. Uh, I think this head is different from the other head. I, I almost want to turn it, but I don't think it turns. Um, yeah, he's kind of looking off a little bit to the side. I don't know if that's an error or not, but he's, he's looking off a little bit to the side. I also noticed he's got a little bit of a mess up on the mouth here. You can see that? That's a little bit of a bummer. You know, usually you don't get too many mess ups on the Funkos. I mean, I, I don't at least. I don't know. Uh, but yeah, it looks like it got a little bit damaged somehow. But the face is really good. We will check it out with the other one. Um, I didn't bring in the other Kong into my Godzilla review, but we will bring it in here because it's Kong and Kong. Um, I don't know. I just didn't grab it before, but I, I will. We'll, we'll get it in here. It's part of the team. Uh, the <laughs> Beast Glove looks really, really good. A lot of nice paint on that as you can see I want to see it even closer pretty well done oh is this messed up too over here that's a bummer meh meh fist itself looks pretty good though so there's that uh the chest looks pretty nice the legs decent enough the back looks pretty decent nice fur detail on this Kong. Nah, it's not bad. You can see a uh, little chip in my paint a little bit better there. Uh, it is what it is. What are you going to do? As you can see, there's a bit of a wash here in the paint. Uh, we saw that on the um, Target exclusive one as well with the Beast Glove and Axe. Um, I like that he's looking to the side a little bit. I don't know if that's, you know you know, the, the, the way it's supposed to be, but I, I do like it. And I like this arm too. It looks pretty good. So it's a, not a bad Funko Kong. And for your size comparisons, I brought these in for the other one. I figure might as well continue. Here is a Kong with the Kong Skull Island, which I'm going to guess is what the super size is. Maybe I'm wrong. Uh, and uh, another Target exclusive. Uh, this uh, was uh, the T-Rex Zord. And of course, here is a Kong with the Target exclusive one who's got uh, orange eyes. So it's very different, yes. And his head is tilted a little bit to the side on this one. Um, the Beast Glove is in a different position. He's got the axe. So it's very, very different, which is cool. And of course, here is a, the previously reviewed Godzilla. And my final thoughts, um, you know, it's got a couple little faults in the paint, a couple little nicks, but otherwise it's, it's a pretty good Funko Kong, you know? Beast Glove looks pretty good. I like the kind of like weird looking smirk almost on his face. The eyes are black here and that's interesting. I, I do dig that. So, I mean, you know, that is so interesting. But it's different than the other Kong we reviewed already. So, um, not bad. Not a bad little piece, you know, as a standard one. Uh, so, yeah. It's fine. It's totally fine. It's a fun go con. I mean, you know, it, it, it's cool. Uh, all of these are pretty cool, like I keep saying on them, and I'm going to keep saying because we got we got more to do, so do stay tuned for that. But I hope you dug this review. Let me know your thoughts down below on it. And if you're new to the channel, why don't you go ahead and sub yourself for daily content. Let me help you diversify your collection. Till next time, peace out, peeps.